Aloha and welcome to the Bear Wozniak Adventure. I'm your adventure guide, Bear Wozniak at Deep Adventure Ministries. We believe that abandoning yourself to the adventure of God's will is the most radical thing you can do in life. And that's why we have as our guest today, David Bates. His website is restlesspilgrim.net and he has this really cool podcast called Pints with Jack. We'll be right back with more of the Bear Wozniak Adventure. Welcome to the Bear Wozniak Adventure. Kickstart that engine and roll thunder with the pack. Explore the grittiness of manly spirituality. Gain traction in the virtues. Zoop up your spiritual engine by turning adversity into adventure. Now here's Bear Wozniak. Let's ride. The title of the talk was C.S. Lewis, Apostle to the Skeptics. And I argue that what made Lewis so great was the fact that he satisfied the reason, but he also engaged the imagination. Oh, I, you know, I think you can say that so much of, uh, of GK also, right? And Absolutely. Tolkien, the, that, that's, that's, can you say that again? What did you say again? Uh, but Lewis, he satisfied your reason, but he engaged and ignited your imagination. Yes. When, when what do you Lewis, mean by that? Well, when, when Lewis would explain something, he would very often use an analogy, uh, a picture in your head for you to hang that idea on. Mm. For example, in Mere Christianity, he speaks about morality. And he's speaking against people that say morality is just simply about how we treat one another. And because that's the part of morality that we can generally all agree on that you shouldn't, that you should be nice to other people, you shouldn't be mean to them. And he says there are actually three parts of morality. It, there's the internal part, there's the external part, and what you might call maybe the teleological part. And he, he gives the example of, uh, of a, a fleet of ships. And he was giving these talks. And, and C.S. Lewis made the statement that his books t- turned against him. Is that what you said? The books yes, he wrote or the books that he loved? The books that he loved and the ones that he was reading. He said, mm-hmm. a young man, if he wishes to remain a faithful atheist, he can never be too careful of his reading. There are traps everywhere. <laughs> it's like what uh, what uh, Cardinal Newman uh, what Newman said um, that to be to be uh, what is deep it? in history is to cease to, to be Protestant. Yeah, to be it's to become Catholic. I'm a big and, fan of of history too. Do you read? I know you. I'm Warren Carroll. I've read all of his 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 whole all of his volumes. I just love to read history. I don't know why. Why am I so drawn? I just read history, history. I, I sometimes I'll read a new book that's 500 years old. You know what I mean? I pretty much live back there. Well, Lewis said, my own eyes are not enough for me. He Mm. saw literature as a means of looking through somebody else's spectacles to be able Mm. to live their lives and and to learn something more about human nature. And so what what was his path then? He said his book started ganging up on him. So principally through philosophy and he was starting to be surrounded by believers on left and right. I don't want you to miss out on your free stuff at deepadventure.com. Go there and subscribe to our weekly email newsletter. You get free video content, including the Bear Wozniak radio show, video version on YouTube before it even airs on EWTN. And you can follow us on all of our social media. Go to deepadventure.com and subscribe. Plus, good stuff happens when you support us at patreon.com forward slash Bear Wozniak Deep Adventure. You get instant access to every radio show, Bear Wozniak Adventure, and our TV episodes, Long Ride Home, the instant we produce them, months before they even air. Plus, we give you all kinds of free stuff, coffee cups, t-shirts, and other things like that. Go to patreon.com forward slash Bear Wozniak Deep Adventure and become our patron. If you're watching on YouTube, don't forget to press the subscribe button and ring that bell. 